If you were to choose one communication device, a two-way UHF radio should be your pick. It is not a replacement for a vehicle installed UHF radio, but it is cheaper and no installation is required. In this video, I show you Ridge Riders Twin Pack 1W two-way UHF CB radio. It comes with a nice carry case for easy transport and storage. These radios have 80 narrowband channels, 83 DCS codes, 38 interference eliminator codes, duplex range extender, channel scan, auto squelch control, dual channel monitor, cold tone alter and backlit display. It comes with a twin charging dock as well as 240 volt and 12 volt chargers. It comes with a manual that not only contains operating instructions but also useful information like CTCSS and DCS functions, VOX, DCM function duplex operation by repeaters, UHF channel guidelines and UHF channels and frequencies. One of the things I like about this handheld radio is that you can use normal AAA sized batteries to power it which makes it quite practical. It claims a range of up to 8 kilometers in ideal conditions. We tried to test this on the longest stretch of highway we can find close to where we live. I got the wife to stand 1.2 kilometers away line of sight and it picked up with no problems. Can you read me from over there? Over. I'll do a follow-up review once we have tested it again at further distances. A two-way UHF radio has quite a lot of uses. Anything from spotting to guide you when out for driving or recovering, tradespeople, sports, skiing, vehicle convoys, group hikes, and parents to check kids in campsites. For example, if they need to go to the toilet. It can also be used to keep in touch with family in theme parks, places like events, markets, bike rides, kayaks, and other watercraft activities. We often camp in remote places with no cell phone reception, and a two-way radio keeps that communication going within the group in the area. It is also perfect for looking after sick members of the family or elderly while they are stuck in bed. And lastly, I think this is an essential part of any emergency kit. Although it has a belt clip, I would suggest these radios have an allocation for something like a carabiner so it can have more attachment options. If you like what you've seen, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. And don't forget to hit that bell to get notifications of any new videos we put up. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.